How do I use soft selection in geometry mode within Unreal Editor? Soft selection is a way that you can transform components of BSP brushes, such as vertices, with a fall-off based on a three-dimensional radius. And basically this means that as you move your selected vertices, other vertices that are a certain distance from your selection will move at a fall-off style rate. Let's take a quick look at how this works. Here, I have a BSP brush that, as you can see, has many different segments. Let's go ahead and jump over to geometry mode. And soft selection has its own little group. If you simply check this on, you can make any selection you like. I'm going to pop up here to the top view. Actually, let's jump over here to the opposite side of the room. I'll hold down Control and Alt and make a marquee selection for the vertices here on the uh, right-hand side. And you'll notice here in perspective that there's a visible part to the falloff where you can see the bright red areas are the actual selected vertices and then we go from bright red down to dark red and eventually to black as we make it to the unselected vertices. Now if we move this selection, you can see that falloff in effect where the uh, vertices are coming along, but you know the next row over doesn't move quite as far, and so on and so forth down the way. We could, of course, uh, rotate this as well and start to form a little bit of an arch, like so. Now, this soft selection is based on a three-dimensional spherical radius, and you can change the uh, radius of that sphere right here inside the text field. So if you need a smaller radius, of course, uh, punch in a lower number, and so on. So let's go ahead and rebuild geometry and lighting. And here we can see the result. We'll pop out of geometry mode, and here's what we have. So we've just created a, a quick arch using BSP. Now, I do want to mention that, generally speaking, you will probably not find yourself using soft selection for much outside of maybe blocking in parts of a level, because, generally, if you have an object that has enough detail uh, to really make use of soft selection, in most cases you'll want that object to be a static mesh and not a BSP brush. But it is here if you need it, and I'm sure there are certain uh, instances where it will come in handy, and that wraps up this How Do I video.